So for this I will need cardboard, white card paper, craft wire, glitter golden dust and so as you can see I have taken two cardboard circles over here and one is big and one is small in size as you can see. Now here is the white card paper stripe I will take it and then I will just fold it give it a little bit rolling shape and then I will just stick it over here on the small circle. So once that is done as you can see it's looking something like this now. Now I'll just stick this on the other circle I've made in this way. So as you can see now it looks like this. Now this is another white card paper stripe and I'll just fold it again like this. After doing this I'll stick it over here. So after that I'll take this white paper and I'll just cut it into a triangle and then fold it with the fingers to make a coiling. So once the coiling is made I made two of these and now I'll just use my fingers to fold the ends like this and two with the same shape. And as you can see I have made four holes on the circle here. So these four holes will attach these white paper coilings like this. So these will be the stands for the birds. So now as you can see these both two stands are now ready. And now I have taken these two white paper and I'll just cut it like this circles and then I'll just give it a little bit uh, you know cone sort of shape and I'll just stick it over here. So these will be the bolts for the uh, food of the birds food and water so I'll just make two of them. So now they are made now I'll just take small tiny strip of white card paper again and I'll just make a ring out of it. As you can see I'll make two of these again like this. So these are the four things which I've made and now I'll just attach it on top on the bottom side of the bowl I've made. So these will be the bowl for the food storage. So now after that's made I'll just stick it on both of the sides like this. So now it's done. Now I've also taken these bird cutouts out of brown card paper and now these cutouts are very easy to make but if you don't know how to make this you can also use printouts. And now over here I'll just take my paper clay and put it in one bowl so it can look like bird food. After that I'll just melt some glue and put it in the other bowl so it will look like clear water. So now as you can see now let's get it dried and now I'll just start making the 3D bird. So I've taken this cut out and then I'll just apply the paper clay on the body of it. So it's very easy to make these 3D birds but also you can also make a paper clay bird which I've made in one of my previous videos. There I've made the complete bird out of only paper clay. But over here I'm showing a little easy step. You can use this paper clay on the card paper cut out and that's what will give you the 3D look for the birds. And these are very very easy and now you'll just make the wings on both of the sides. So as you can see it's done now. 
and one bird is completed now i've done three of them and now i'll just get them dry and start painting it so over here i'm painting it with yellow paint yellow acrylic paint because i want the birds to be very bright and vibrant in color so i'll just use this paint and now i'll just paint the body with the yellow acrylic paint and then i'll just give it the highlights with a uh, orange paint over here somewhere on the body and then i'll just merge these two paints together now i'll just paint the other half of the body with black paint and now i'll just use some white acrylic paint and give the little shade on the feathers and the beak of the bird and also the eyes so as you can see i'm just making this and it's very cute little adorable birds and i just love this so as you can see i made three of them like this and all are now dry now the painting is done for the bird now we'll start painting the base and i'm painting the base with white acrylic paint you can also paint any other paint if you want but i'll suggest you use white paint for the base it looks really good and then i'll just tap some brown paint on the foot of the birds so once it's dried now i'll just start sticking the bird on this stand but before that as you can see i've taken this white paper and i'll just cut out these stripes no uh, not white paper exactly white card paper because that's hard and now I be as you can see I've made hundreds of these and now I'll just keep them aside and stick the birds on the base Now I'll just keep the third bird aside because that will I'll just stick that later now I'll just start taking these uh, card paper stripes and I'll just start making a net out of it and it's really easy you just have to have patience and stick one by one and that will give you the perfect desired design you want for the cage so just have patience and do this as you can see this is how it looks and it's looking something like this a net sort of a shape and now i'll just uh, make it more secure by applying another strip over the other side so that it gets secured properly and now for the bottom i'll just take this foam sheet stripe and i'll just stick it over here So as you can see it's looking something like this now again i'll just secure the end again so i'll just stick it another part on the back side in this way so after that is done now i'll just stick that in with the base and it will look really beautiful just trust me and keep watching so i'll just stick it like this So once this is done now I'll, I'll just bend the top with my hands little bit and now I'll just stick the another part of card paper stripe on top of it or you can also stick foam sheet stripe over here So make sure you do it carefully and now this is how it looks half of it is already done now for the top half I'll just take this cardboard ring and i'll just fold it so it will give you slightly bended effect like this and now i'll just stick it over here so now this is done now i'll just take these two cardboard cutouts and these two have the holes in the middle so this will be for the top of the cage and now i'll just take this craft wire and i'll just make a loop of it
and now I'll just attach it with this card paper and then fold the corners on the opposite side so it can get secured properly so I'm using my plier so as you can see now I've taken another coiling white paper coiling for the swing and I'll just fold it like this so I'll just attach it over here on the top of the closing of the cage and now I'll attach the third bird which I've left on this so this will be the swing and then I'll attach it on the closed part of the cage so it's now done as you can see now for the door the bird cage door I'll just take some more paper stripes on different directions you can use your creativity over here and it's really very easy Now I'll also make a cross over here. So now as you can see this is now completed and the loop is also attached on top so this is how it looks. You can also keep it white. But if you want you can paint it with golden glitter dust like I am doing. So I'll just take a bowl and put some glitter dust, put some glue. And then you have just have to use the brush and paint it. So using the clear glue will also help you when it dries. It will only show you the glitter dust not the glue so it also looks really great. So now I'll just paint the complete cage with this paint. So as you can see now this is done and this is how it looks which looks really very beautiful and golden in color so I just love this and to be very honest, honest it look and to be very honest it is one of my favorite videos so far and I just love this so as you can see this is how it looks when I hung it on a piece of nail on my wall so this is how it looks and the birds are looking really cute so this is how it looks guys this is the complete video i hope you like this video if you did please make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and make sure you hit the bell icon so that whenever i post a new video you will be notified till next time bye bye